Governor Gavin Newsom is at it again, gaslighting California residents. The latest is a post he just made on Twitter, giving himself credit for cleaning up debris and litter throughout the entire state of California. He wants you to know that he's doing a good job with that. Has he been to any of the homeless camps lately? Coming up, we're going to share with you his post, and I will give a unvarnished rebuttal. I'm Carl DeMaio, chairman of Reform California, and you know that on this podcast, we have criticized Governor Gavin Newsom and his failure to deal with homelessness in our state. He has led uh, a policy failure for the past 15 years, because you have to include his time as San Francisco mayor, uh, a policy failure on homelessness, unlike the which we've never seen across this country. Homelessness has spiked. And as a result, you see the devastation in the streets every day, the the crime, the grime, the filth, the public health hazard. You are literally seeing trash strewn about. A recent estimate uh, for Caltrans uh, pegs its maintenance budget is consumed by about a third, one third of its entire maintenance budget goes to cleaning up homeless camps uh, along the side of the roads. We have a massive problem with the grime associated with homelessness in the state of California. It is undeniable. You see it with your own eyes. Some of you who live in the urban areas every single moment of the day. But Governor Gavin Newsom has the audacity to go to Twitter today and give himself praise. He wants you to thank him for cleaning up litter in the state of California. Here's the post. It says, since launching Clean California, we've removed 1.9 million cubic yards of trash from state highways and created 4,000 jobs. Um, okay. But since failing on homelessness, you've probably added uh, probably 100 million cubic yards of trash to our neighborhoods and our communities. A lot of that, by the way, fecal matter on the sidewalks. He goes on to say, quote, now we're funding 60 more projects across the state to revitalize public spaces, specifically transit centers like this one in San Francisco, the Muni Station in San Francisco. Um, He is joking, right? Like he gets he gets like how awful this is. I mean, the reason why he's able to get away with this is that the liberal media in California, they're not going to call him out. We are going to call him out. We're going to mock him on this channel. Wait till you see the video here. I've got a. Enjoy this, enjoy this with you. So two years ago, we launched Clean California. as a $1.1 billion program to do just wait, this. Wait, 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 wait. <sighs> A $1.1 billion program two years ago. It's a $1.1 billion program to clean up litter and grime from the homeless epidemic that I've created. And we'll never be able to... Uh, send enough nannies out, enough uh, cleaning maids out to clean up after the homeless. How about this, Mr. Governor? Why don't we deal with homelessness and get that grime off the street so that we don't have to constantly go out and have a trash service deliver, uh, trash service uh, 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 system for all these public safe uh, uh, public places? Again, this guy just spent two billion dollars, two billion with a B on cleaning up. Basically, we know where the trash is coming from. It's coming from homeless people. It is not just generic trash that's out there. This is homelessness. Clean up this state. We're putting out today $114 million. 14 of those $114 million will be for revitalizing public spaces like this, specifically targeting transit areas, bus stops, address the issue of graffiti and beautification. Those dollars are going out in real time. We don't have time. It's time to clean up this state. So two we don't ago, have we time. It's time to clean up this state. Give me credit for spending $2 billion to go out and pick up trash after homeless people, homeless people who are out there because he has failed to actually do what other states do, which is use law enforcement to get people compulsory treatment for mental health and substance abuse addiction. We've covered homelessness in other podcasts. If you are interested in learning more about why 
Newsom has failed on homelessness. We've got the receipts. We will post in the um, section below, comment section below, a link to the homelessness podcast that we uh, have out there that explains the whole failure of Newsom's regime. But this is so mockworthy. This is so laughable that he's trying to take a victory lap um, for basically saying, oh, look at me. I've spent a bunch of taxpayer money, wasted a bunch of taxpayer money to try to mitigate the disaster that I've created with homelessness. And the media won't call him out on it. I mean, again, this is mock worthy. This is like someone, this is like the captain of the Titanic saying, hey, look at me, give me credit. I just uh, bailed out one bucket of water. Yeah, you thankful yet? This guy's a clown, an absolute clown, inept, way over his head. He's a failed governor, but the thing he has going for him is the liberal media in California that refuses to show pictures like this. So if you go on to, YouTube and just Google homeless camp San Francisco because he was standing in San Francisco. This is what comes up. Look at these images. Two months ago, one month ago. Oh, here's one. One year ago. Look at that. Oh, look at that entire homeless camp in Santa Cruz. Um, here's another one two months ago. Here's another one. Eviction for Wood Street homeless encampment. Look at that. Look at all of that trash. Governor, your Clean California $2 billion program looks like it missed a spot. Again, you and I both know that this guy is an absolute fraud. And he is throwing good money after bad rather than addressing the root cause, which is people on the street who are creating these messes uh, and in, in basically imposing those, uh, those impacts on you and me. De deteriorating the quality of life in our neighborhoods. Look, we have a better plan for homelessness uh, than to try to throw $2 billion after putting basically a Band-Aid on a gaping wound. You can get that plan online at cleanuparstreets.org, cleanuparstreets.org. And I really hope that you will support our cause at Reform California to come up with a better program to deal with homelessness so we don't have to spend $2 billion trying to chase people around who are littering and creating all sorts of grime uh, and uh, um, uh, uh, trash really in our community. Um, we need you to contribute because we're completely funded by grassroots contributors like yourself. The average contribution is $67 a year. Okay, that's the average. You can just throw in five bucks and we appreciate it. Also sign up to be a volunteer because we do provide our voter guide every election, the plain English voter guide so that people know who to vote for and where they stand on the issues of homelessness, crime, taxes, schools, and so many other important issues. And finally, help us share this video. You're not going to see any media outlet mocking Newsom, calling him out for his fraudulent pats on the back for his $2 billion wasteful clean California program. Um, look, I'd be all for a clean California program if you weren't intentionally causing so much more uh, disaster and uh, crime and grime and, and trash with a homeless policy that's fatally flawed. Uh, so help us break through the censorship of the liberal media by liking and subscribing uh, to this channel. Like the video, subscribe to this channel, and of course, share the video with your friends. Until next time, Carl DeMaio, Chairman of Reform California. Thanks for watching. Help us break through the censorship of the liberal media by liking this video, sharing it with your friends, and subscribe to my YouTube channel.